Welcome to How to Chant for Money. If this is your first time on my channel and you like videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. Welcome to the tribe, guys. So I made this video to teach people how to chant for money. There's so many different ways you can chant or what you can chant for, but today we're gonna be focused on money, okay? So first of all, chanting is an ancient technique. It's been done for thousands of years and chanting is very sacred. It's a sacred technique. It is your communication between the universe and the spiritual realm. So when you chant, you want to receive something, right? Chanting is a receptive practice. And I don't think a lot of people know that. When you're chanting, it's because you want to receive something, whether that is world peace, love, or money. So today we're focused on how to chant for money. So the word chant literally means to sing. So whether you're speaking the words, whether you're chanting the words, the word chant or chanting literally means to sing. So as we know, chanting is the sacred dialogue between you and the spiritual realms and the universe. So when you chant, you are, you are also creating vibrations, okay? And these vibrations bring you back pretty much what you're asking the universe or the spiritual realms for. Now, you can chant with your eyes open or you can chant with your eyes closed. It does not matter when it comes to chanting because once you start chanting your chant, you are going to go into a deep meditative state whether your eyes are opened or closed. There are some people who like to get into a deep meditative state first, they close their eyes and then they start chanting. And that is fine as well. I feel like that practice has the most power. Before you chant, it is very important to take deep breaths. And when you start chanting, chant from the belly, the solar plexus, because this is our creative field. This is where um, a lot of our manifestations are blocked because we cannot access our creative chakra, which is the solar plexus. Now also the root chakra most likely is blocked as well if you are trying to manifest money, the root and the, the sacral. But the root is more important when it comes to money. Now, once you start chanting for money, when you're saying that money, 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 come to me, okay? Your root chakra is going to start opening. Remember, chants create a vibration and the chakras in the body begin to open. When you're chanting for money, it is very important to have this feeling of gratitude already in your soul, in your stomach. Just be grateful that day for whatever you have, whatever money you have, whatever you know things that you've bought, whatever your living situation is, whatever you can be grateful for at that moment. Be grateful for it while you're chanting because gratitude pulls the vibration of abundance. So when you're chanting, money, 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 come to me, you wanna have this feeling of gratitude because it is going to create the vibration of abundance, which is going to bring money to you. That is why my money, money chant is so effective and it works. I wanna say 98% of the people who use that chant, it works. So let's talk about why it doesn't work, okay? Let's get into that. So for the small percentage of the people that chanting for money does not work for, there is this thing called faith while doubting. A lot of you are saying the chant and you have faith in the chant, 
but you're also doubting the effects of the chant. So it's kind of like you can't have faith in this chant and you're chanting it, but meanwhile, deep down inside, you are doubting the effects. You, you doubt if it's even going to work. It's like you believe, but you don't believe. If you have faith while chanting and doubting the effects or the outcomes, you will get zero or low results from the chant because you're chanting with faith, but you're doubting the outcomes that it will even work, the effectiveness of the chant. So that's called having faith while doubting. And that is the number one reason most money chants are not working for people. Or let's say that you're chanting for money and it's working, but you're only creating small gains. It's because somewhere deep down inside, you are doubting the effectiveness that this chant can really bring you money. You have faith while you're doing it, but you're also doubting that it can really happen in the first place, okay? So you cannot have faith and doubt the outcome at the same time. Once again, you will get zero results or little results. So if you are chanting for money and you're seeing small gains, just know you have to clear out that doubt. So the doubt is if the chant is going to work or if it's going to be effective. You're saying the chant with faith, but doubting it deep down inside. This is what ruins um, a lot of the money chants for the small percentage of people that it is not working for. So thank you for joining me today. I wanted to get right down to the point of how to chant for money so that it works effectively for you. And I also wanted to tell you guys why it's not working for a small percentage of you. So thank you very much for being here with me today and learning how to chant for money. <laughs>